tortillas and you'll be delighted. The only thing you'll want to do is cook this recipe. We'll eat on the tortilla and spreading it all over the surface. I'm showing you just two, but I made some everyone loves them. Nothing is ever left over. I prepare tortillas like this almost. To continue, add some diced onion. We'll continue seasoning with a little salt to taste of garlic powder. And finally, ground black pepper to taste. And you'll re tortillas you want. In a pan, add a little olive oil and brush it to grease the pan well. Place the tortilla with the minced meat side down and fry it for five minutes. Where you are watching us from so we can send you a greeting in our next recipe. Your sub love knowing that you're enjoying our recipes and our meat is well fried. Now we're going so as not to burn ourselves. It's time to put a slice of cheese on top. It can be any brand you prefer from the pan and set it aside briefly. Now let's prepare our sauce. Add three tablespoons of mayonnaise of ketchup. Also a tablespoon of mustard, two crushed garlic cloves and a tablespoon. Now you just have to mix well. This sauce will perfectly cook. If this is the first time you've seen one of my recipes, what a joy to have you here. Please let me from to send you a special greeting. Now we'll fill our tortillas with two slices of fresh tomato, popped lettuce, red onion to taste. We'll fill all the tortillas the same way. Perfect for lunches, snacks, or dinners. You can enjoy this delicious of the day. Then I'll place the filled tortillas in this baking dish and add a tablespoon. By the way, could you tell me from which country you are watching us? I'd love to send you a greeting. Today, I want to send a big greeting to Fanny Lee from Colorado, Luciano Benetti, Sana Chaudhary, who follows us from Pakistan. Greetings and thank you for being part of our community recipes. And there you go. Our minced meat tortillas are ready. Look how delicious and easy recipe to prepare. You're sure to enjoy every bite. Mention you'd love to share this delicious recipe and save it to have it ready when you decide to make it at home. The first time you've seen one of my recipes. I hope you enjoyed following this and sharing it with you. I wholeheartedly thank everyone for watching my recipe tune in the next recipe.